Mama vana se ma Pen Dream TV. Pen Dream TV dia osi adam yopo. Se se idia me kana se imu aye de pa se benta. Enye agro kwa o Parliament. Dia e koso o Parliament ni. I mean, let me say, uh, the air cosso a war, a speaker of parliament, and the executive, ah, me can say, President Akufuado, and the dark oman, and yet for the agro crowd, a moi de papa, 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 just a air tough. You see, a quiet chima mention. Nancy, I may be bought my book video be at the chermo. Now, me perset me, 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 um and fear fear hono na moti the air cosso no asi answer. Nancy ya ena uh se mobile kaya a ye um oman pinini a kufuado uh parliamentarian si a ye uh mo passe a ye anti LGBTQ plus uh bill no or mo passi we no or mo ye se comma de coma or man pinini uh a kufuado nanka was was sent it to it. Nanka afidi abedane emra. Na emra no echele se. Se oma mpe nini. Ensa kasa aleta na naso wadu. Nchile biwa huwa nasi bibiwa huwa. Ompa. Nwa se. Obesa retene ne back. To the parliament. Nwa chura kan. Ose si ni si. Ene wuma ne ninja huwa. Ana se. Um, Obe communicate with the. Uh, council of um, elders. Na. Wa chetche omo di. Onu fi se. Owa si ye fa huwa. Na advice be on the man nature say, Ye the above parliament back, na ya yes, ah, amendments, no, na a fee, ye the abren, na obesanya, na wa sign. Na a semi echo, a bye, ya, a ye parliamentarians, a passe, sa anti LGBTQ, no. Ye could see ya, and say, O man pinny a kufuado, ku kwa pie, or say, I didn't tea any ya, 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 yes, ah, dear, no, a dear breno. Eche se on peso wa sign. Enti quickly, on ma on wan kasan executive secretary, a ye asanti be due to a trolete. E de koma the clerk of parliament se hey, sa a diye na ma pase no fi ye kran wan fam fa ka. Dusu 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 se o de ba flagstaff house o. So asumo de ba ho. Ye be shumwa. Ye be brumu pa. Mti ma mon fam ma ho kra. Ye in hiyano wa hanom. Aha, na matese krufu bi kwen pu uko kot. Ewa, di eno hunti no. Mon chen, na kot mo, en ka asem ni wiyan sa na modi aba. Asem wei ek ba a eno, enu mwa, ena echele se, em, parlement so so, defi ya mako, ona bo defi ya mako, ono so so, waye parlementeri, eno ono so so, echele mwa. Oma mpe nyini, Oso wa ere shafo, o ye ere shafo no, ye wo ministers bi wa u yiyo mo di, oso wa jyo mo juma ef yo mo yisem. Later, na oso wa appoint, wa sa re appoint yo mo. Now, so wa re appoint yo mo di ya, na emrane chile se, ni panon e waso oba, court ho, like parliamentarian so, na ye vetin, oba vetin komiti, na komiti no, esa vetin, re vetin no, an sa na, se ya provuna afi ba bia o mampeni pese o de ne ko no na o de ne ko so o mampeni o mpese ya vet o minister bia e transfer na o ye we ka se oki me yi weed na ko ha me yi weed na ko ha me yi weed na ko ha o nka se wa je nipa na juma firi ni nsam na later o kwa o se ma re appoint no o re appoint ni pe e be ya new portfolio enti na o so sab go through the uh, what do you call it the vetting Eno, ena, oma mpe yini, ede, eba, efen se ni, ministers na, fo, afo, fro, no, ode, omo ba, eni, yon, ki kan, ode, ode, ba, ese, yen, veti, omo. Ena, ona, bo, defi, yama, poso, se, chile, se, sa, an, kro, fo, na, omo, oma mpe yini, yi, omo, di, na, oma, mba, fo, veti, ni, ti, no, ono, se, nyan, di, ono, so, bepeni, because, so, mo, bu, mra, so, ti, se, ti, sa, di, ono, so, oko, kot, na, ono, so, di, njanshin, ako, to, so, Sedi ye wo oman pe nyini, wo se obi e di njanshin a koto, e ye anti-LGBTQ bail no so, e ti no wo a senti to eight, wo chanya mo mo yi no. E di ono so ko, no ono so di, e fè ni se in, njanshin a koto so, e no ono so di koto so, ono so di koto so no, e na, quick, e ye attorney general, e tro lete, ye si ye fre bibi mramu, ye fre bibi expedited, 
um uh, uh, appeal o se deben e na o tro sa expedited appeal no e de koma supreme court se azia no e o hian intentem sa mu ai ne de o hian intentem because eh a ban bi hian de aye ne nyoma e na che se o mu eko supreme court e fresh sa asem no na ndc for so chere se ah e ye anti lgbtq eh bill no Nipa, a eh, yes, ka, eh, the last kaya or day as a mono bar court or no. Or the barbe two weeks and sunny ye nipa no de ne de eba. It is a view, sanky ye be dear some pa, ye ni can di 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 kaino as a mono. Ye di wea and sunny ni or tossum ye nye de aba. And also so anko ye juma. And a moody can co ye di or no de ne de eba late ne eh, ndi si ni di and some more person will trash it like mo kaino a few ho. Send a bea. O man pe yini di ono pe no, mo be yama no. Na endi si foche se, no, eno so so di e, e ko bana sa anye ye. Go omu ko du koto ono, in fact, ye tuase mnu guye. Enti, endi si foche li mwa, ene che se, e ye adia, en, 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 cha, 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 se wo um, supreme court for some say attorney general at the law your friend expedited appeal and a buy it in a man we are a quick demand yeah then yes also yeah ba now yes so yeah the expedited law no at the abe appeal for a year um anti lgbtq plus bill no na musu mundi ni ntemo fresh asa mna ntemi kwa hii jano hwa anusha na musu mwe bume nye gunti yesu ye de ye ye pepe se ba yesu ye ba ni abe abe apeli sedi ye atuni jini nya efasa amra ni ye juma yesu ye efade se mumra ni yesu ye de ye juma ni ape ni ni niti 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 speaker of parliament pese o chese aso supreme court of war no jyo mo ye no e ye bwa pa ye Eye mafia. Ana se eye emra eno muyusu. Se emra na muyusu diya. Na se mesome lawyers abba. So mosu so emra na attorney general. E yusi ye no. A ye fen expedited laws. Expedited. E fen se appeal na omu be ye ye na mojitu mso ke endi ye. Ebrebe frasa mna nite mo no. Mesome nkro fo di be yusu di se emra no. No mosu e di abba. Se mosu mo mfre anti LGBTQ plus asa mna nite mo. Ni yesu yi ndi asa mwono. Na ye nche di ye. E da ye ni mwono. Enti. E no. E na e ye. Speaker of Parliament. So so. Asuma. Ama. Ne let. Ne 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 lawyer. So so. Ako Supreme Court. E se di ye. Ye wa chwendi ye mwa. Ye nche di ye Supreme Court. Be ye. We. Ya di Supreme Court. Ache. E ye. E e e. Fidi ye. Eh. Ye sum ne fidi ye. E si ye wu ni mwono. Na se wang ko. Wang mwa. Wos wang fre. Asa mwono ni tempe. Supreme uh, Speaker of Parliament, but we say, ah, nature say mafia. Okay, so Obia be you sue or no the office, the mafia, they are then you are telling me as the NDC Speaker of Parliament, ah, NDC for the demi by a better way, but mommy, a mommy, we need an essay. Then I will also use my office to do mafiarism. Yes, so Munina or Mampini, then office executive, no air mafia. That's a Muslim Supreme Court. Muslim de mo diye ekwe ya mafia de. Then you are telling me, Speaker of Parliament, say me so so me inform me office enya mafia de. Na afi ma huni se enya amamu ni ebu. Then mum we are doing mafiarism. Ti ese diye ebe ya de 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 ese kumha ebe ya de se. Mo ana mufi se Speaker of Parliament na oya ya mre ya se ni ni ane se no ufi se. Aya mamu, ye yina yenke yi timbo mu. E ni kwa anso wa ye ni nyo ma chen chene na e ma. A mamu no, a na fence governance no. E ye, like, e ye on governable. A na se, e a bayon cheno. Bebri debi. Ye yina ye ye ne koswa ebe buwa ye. E no, no so sometimes, e biwa na MPP for diye kwa mpu nye. Ba nwe bu ne niye gusu se o diye. E nchwe mu, ni yenko. Sa anu wa ya, bepu mwen de bat ne. Sa mo pesu mo chire ne se. Mu ye nyansa fwo, en onu ye kwa siya, o ni mi nyansa. Ok, this is the time. Me so so me chila mo pepe. 
enti yanko tv3 ni yanko hwe eye honorable mahama ayarga ne nsemo a ono so kafa asemi hu na okiremu a o mampeni akufu ado wo ye arrogant chese eno hu ye ne nwanwa na de omodia ye supreme court ndi just want to see something omo be he ni supreme court be ye omo be teno omo sum na fidi na se supreme court bo no hu musuo na the expedited law na na expedited appeal na eh eh fan say speak of parliament call for the lawyers so dia ba no so mo fra asem ne ntem so ma fra a e che so ki ma mo mo hu se ah okay na che say everybody is using the office to do mafiarism but at the end of the day you were the executive and sa na the legislature no aba ah no speak of parliament no kra no di or or fan say ono di kan ba ansa na mo judiciary no aba it is a mo na mo di machin mo sum tumi use mo office de be mafia me dia then i can also use my office to do the mafia is ni ahwe kroma de owo tumi yes it e say how grow up be be see kroma no enye is yan ko ne yan ko hwe eh wo the key point so tv3 said ye eye mahama ayarga e ka ne nsam e fa e mr ansa na e be call mr so be subscribe to pen dream tv patcho o ba ya first thing first like video no mai o like pe e bo ama sa video ko a chire mo man afofro so enya bi e hwe nti o ba ya no like e dia mai o wa venture bi a na o dia to comment section no ase e dia mai na wa share so so ama afofro to me enya bi a hwe yen ko na yen ko hwe ensam no sade e ko so e wo tv tre no ni ensamra e meto a enko mo no so once again good morning to viewers and colleagues on the panel we can go into legal niceties and etc. But I think that it is important to appreciate the broader context of what is happening. It is essentially a standoff between the executive arm of government and the legislative arm of government in which both sides are maneuvering to achieve their objectives and in the maneuver they are both exploiting the opportunities available in the use of the judiciary as an arbiter and the manager of disputes between the two arms of government as stipulated by the constitution and so essentially, it is a political tussle, not really, in my opinion, a fine legal mm. issue, if you ask me. For instance, the question you asked, generally it is the practice that when you initiate an action in the Supreme Court, there are timelines within which certain steps must be taken. But at the same time, an interested party can seek to rush the court by requesting that the court undertakes an expedited hearing of his or her case if the exigencies dictate that. And the decision to expedite hearing of a matter is purely an administrative matter uh, that the Chief Justice will have to determine and take a decision on. In all sincerity and honesty, I honestly will not fault the Chief Justice or the Supreme Court in this matter. And I'm happy that the Speaker's lawyers have also taken the step that the Attorney General took, which is also right to the, 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 the yes. Chief Justice, mm -hmm. and also demand expedited hearing of uh, their case. It is the reaction of the Chief Justice yeah. in this instance that will determine whether the Chief Justice Bias. is biased or not. Yeah. She's been given the opportunity mm. to determine whether or not she will act in a biased manner or not. So I will not rush in passing judgment about the conduct of the Chief Justice because the Attorney General has 
a good defense, which is, look, you brought an action against me, and I feel I need to have the matter heard expeditiously. So I've written to the Chief Justice. There's a debate among the lawyers as to whether or not when the Attorney General writes to the Chief Justice demanding expedited hearing of a matter in which he is involved, mm -hmm. he should copy the lawyers on the, other, on side the other side or mm -hmm. not. In fact, I, I don't think that is legally mandatory. Really? Because, because that, that was one of the major arguments yes, of, uh, yeah. of uh, the, the likes of uh, Edujita Maglo when I spoke to him within the week, that in, in the, the rules of court allow for this, this uh, expedited hearing. But what you do is that you file a formal application and that would enable the other party to be duly served. Then the parties appear before maybe a judge or a panel of judges sees with the jurisdiction to, to hear the matter. And they will not determine or not whether this application of the uh, the expedited hearing should be granted, and, and the no, other party that, should be duly notified that so is, they know. That is when there is a return date. That is when a date has been fixed mm -hmm. to hear the matter. And if you now seek expedited, you know, hearing of the matter, it means that you want to abridge time, you want mm -hmm. an early hearing, and the other side has already been notified that the case is going to be heard on the twenty fifth. You wanted to, to be heard on the 12th. Mm -hmm. So in that instance, it is only fair and proper that it is an application and that the other side who is sitting and aware that the case is going to be heard on the 25th mm -hmm. must be given notice. And in this case, according in this to case, the lawyers... A date was not fixed. Okay. A date was not fixed for hearing. He had filed it and then he had 14 days mm -hmm. to file his statement of case. He had not yet filed a statement of case. Yes. In the substantive writ, he had asked for an interlocutory injunction, uh, injunction which normally would be followed by a motion for uh, an interlocutory injunction. He hadn't done that uh, yet. And so, you know, there is an argument against why the court will rush and have expedited hearing of the matter when they haven't even benefited from seeing the arguments in the statement of case. Mm. There's a case for making that argument. Right. That if you had probably waited to see the arguments, to read the arguments in the statement of case, because your statement of case essentially contains your, your legal arguments. Mm -hmm. So if, if you had waited and seen the arguments, maybe that could influence your mind when considering whether that party deserves an interlocutory injunction to be issued or not in his favor. So I have read Tadiosori's letter to the Chief Justice, mm -hmm. and I noticed, and Tadio is one of the very brilliant guys around, and he indirectly alludes to that uh, argument. There's mm -hmm. a strong argument in that, in, that, in that respect. But because a return date had not been given, mm -hmm. and the AG decided to write to the Chief Justice to demand expedited hearing, professionally, if he had copied the party on the other side, it just shows that he's a fine gentleman. Mm -hmm. If he decides to take them by surprise and then quietly write to the Chief Justice, he doesn't breach any rule or law, but it's just not fine, mm -hmm. if you ask me. But whether he breached the law, no. So, like I said... This it's not legally mandatory when there's no return date? Yes for the other party in the case to be notified yes. when there's a, an application for expedited hearing. Yes, and, and that is why so far nobody has shown any specific rule that says that it must be done. Otherwise, I'm sure we would have been shown that by now. But the point really is that, you know, it is in the context of a political tussle mm -hmm. and everybody is maneuvering. And I understand the maneuvering because I cannot deny that I'm, I'm, I'm involved and part of the, the maneuvering, being mm -hmm. a, a certain member of parliament mm -hmm. and on the minority side. And it is really because the president has consistently, you know, violated the constitution. Consistently. It started with the death penalty, you know, uh, prohibition that we passed. Mm -hmm. Then the witchcraft legislation that we passed. And the president consistently refused to sign these bills after we had passed them and refused to comply with the provisions of Article 106 of the Constitution. That says that if you are not signing, 
return it to us and tell us why you are not signing. If you need further advice, refer it to the Council of State and get their view on the matter. And then if you have issues with any provisions, highlight those provisions, make your argument why you think those provisions must be changed one way or the other, send it back to us. And we as a parliament, if we feel strongly about it, then we should mobilize two-thirds of our numbers to pass that legislation. Mm -hmm. And once we mobilize two-thirds of our numbers to pass the legislation, you are duty-bound as a president to sign it. Why a president who controls or claims to control a majority of the members of parliament cannot engage in this simple step and then get his side not to vote with the minority to, to, to make it impossible for us to get the two-thirds? Which is actually what you should do constitutionally. That's easy. That's easy. That is easy. I, I don't know what is informing the behavior of the president. Whether he thinks that he is above the constitution, above the law in this country, and can do as he pleases in such a constitutional democracy. So I may not necessarily agree with people about the legal positions that they take. But in principle, I agree with the fight with the president on this particular matter, that if we don't manage the behavior of this president, he's going to set a very bad precedent for future presidents. Don't forget that this is a democracy and we expect it to endure for centuries to come. Mm -hmm. And once we begin admitting bad behavior by presidents that think that they are above the law and above the constitution, we don't know where they will carry it. Next time, it has to do with the elections. They may change the election date. They may even refuse to hand over when they have lost it and that kind of thing. So as a country, we must be vigilant because as for democracy, you need to protect it. And you have to protect it because creeping dictatorship, it starts small in areas that you think are really not serious. But once people test the ability to defy the constitution and don't get a response from the population, they increase the dose and they get to a point where the democracy itself will be seriously undermined. So I'm not really very particular about the petty legal niceties. Mm -hmm. Was returned, did there, was returned, did not there. When he wrote the letter, did he copy the Attorney General? Did he not copy the Attorney General? Because in the process of these petty minor debates, we lose the major issue why the fight is going on. Mm -hmm. The fight is going on because Parliament has passed a series of legislation of significant social implications. Why? This country, we have a death penalty legislation. No president has signed that anybody should be executed. So why should we continue having it in our books? So an MP brings a bill. The whole of parliament goes through the process, spends public money, processes it, agrees on it, votes for it. President says, I won't sign. Witchcraft. Women are being accused falsely of being witches. Some held up in witches' mm -hmm. uh, camps. Some have lynched. Been for years, Governments have been pretending that they are doing something about it. And yet the basic legislative framework that will enable you to take firm action has not been present. Parliamentarians sit and say, no, let's take action. Let's take the initiative. We take the initiative. We pass the legislation. People that pretend that they are concerned about witchcraft and then the plight of women who are alleged to be witches refuse to sign the bill. And nobody sees anything wrong with it. Then... LGBT bill then comes and we go through the labor of passing it. The president has a majority of the MPs in that parliament. His MPs join a unanimously vote for it. We send it to him. Then he sits there and writes us a letter to cease and desist even bringing the bill to his uh, presidency. I mean, that level of arrogance, I have never seen it before. I mean, basic modesty would dictate that you receive the letter from a coordinate branch of government. If you disagree, basic constitutional law, eh? constitutional law 101. Yes, 101. You don't even need to get to second year constitutional law no. to understand that there are mechanisms open to you as a president. If you don't agree with it, raise the constitutional issues, mm -hmm. send it back to us. You have resort to the Council of State. Let them lend, them, lend you their support. Send it back to us. Demand that we mobilize two thirds of our numbers. I bet you, if the president is serious, given the hold he has on his MPs in parliament, then this might never be able 
to mobilize to third majority. But he wants to appropriate and reprobate. He wants to appear, he and his party, to appear to support the LGBTQ legislation in Parliament. And yet, when the bill gets to him at the Flagstaff House for him to append his uh, signature, he will find some way he of avoiding it. He said, don't even bring it. Don't you know, bring it to Don't even bring it to, to, to me. <laughs> so, they go out and tell the churches and then the mosque and the clergy and civil society, oh, we're not even against it all. Don't you see that our MPs voted for it? Did you see our MPs oppose it? Sign it to you and sign it. Yeah. If you receive it, so don't even bring it near me. Mm -hmm. I mean, what kind of a game is this? So the petty issues, me, I'm not interested, to be frank with you, and I'm not about to lie for anybody or defend anybody if I'm not convinced about it. But the fundamental issues are there, and I don't want us to lose track of what the fundamental issues are. As for the <coughs> Supreme Court, I think that we should be careful how we relate to the Supreme Court. We should always take our time and look through things carefully. Because, you see, when we destroy the reputation of our Supreme Court, and I'm talking about both the conduct of the judges themselves, is that okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. And then the conduct of we, the other political actors, if we all behave in ways that destroy the image of the Supreme Court, we will be weakening a very critical element in a functioning democracy, mm. which Injustice. is the ability of a court to hold a balance. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. So the court must live above reproach. But at the same time, we those who always walk to them and seek justice must also be careful in the way that we analyze their behavior so that it doesn't destroy that institution. So it's, 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 it's uh, both ways. That's what I can say as an initial take on the matters before you this morning. And you, you look at the bigger picture. And well said. Well said, yeah. indeed. Thank you very much, uh, Mama Yarga, on this. And then the fact that the premise, in fact, the foundation for what we are experiencing right now is, is the position taken by the president. And then this is where I bring in uh, Lawyer Buedu, because in the end, if a decision had been taken, first of all, this matter would not be in court in the first place. The foundation for where we are now is one, the Attorney General's own advice to the President. The President takes that particular position on the anti lgbtq plus bill. Now I have something to say okay, about, okay, if you permit okay, me later okay, on, yeah, I have something okay, to say about the Attorney General's advice to the President. Yeah, no, I, I want, okay, I will, I, will come, I will come to that briefly. Does it now not, not concern you that in the midst of all this and then the Attorney General now goes to court, reveals that indeed, as we have gotten to know now, it is not legally wrong what he did to file for an expedited hearing, even though the other party had not been notified. That's one of the concerns that the other party raised, that look, there was no notification of this expedited hearing to the extent that the lawyers of Nelson Rocks and Dafia Mapo were not in court when this case was heard. Taking into consideration all this, what should be the position of the presidency about a law or a bill that it appears or is the case that both sides of the House supported it? Thank you. So, anti Sadia Michichimu is fine. And why, and a uh, Honorable Mahama Ayarga, or no so so, I didn't name someone at Toho, Eddie Amain, and one no, no, and I make him much material from beginning. You see, they say, you know, I drew uh, mafiarism, Ubiam Fanny Office, and Fan Mafia, they say, and no, and a Speaker of Parliament, or her, and no, or chain, no, no, a so so didn't any idea. Oh, now if you want say, okay, if it is time, or if it has been accepted. Say, Obian, you see the office and find your mafiarism there. Then, say, Miss me speaker, Miss me start to say, me you see me officer, ma Obia and try say, or because I say, oh, ha government, and now, oh, yeah, my government, now you're ungovernable, and if I'm Chris Derby, it is time because you're so so end this for no, yes, we ain't nipper. What you ask here, yes, we ain't nipper. And say, Ecobana say, 
mono mo pese de bia no mo ma ndc for look like say omo no ye nwe omo ye mponche omo de omo ni mi nya ansa mo na mo ni mo mra ni e ho ade no nya so mo ni mo mra o they know the law sabe constitution na ye mra na mo mo bom ho sa fo hene se mo ni mo e ye ndc for na chro ye in fact wo bra ndc for cry chro constitution no mo mp before mo twem ho firi mo mo twem ho firi mo se mo mo nye bi mo mfa mo ho nka ho na e fe nsen mo mpe se like money nje rollins ho ne ho ade mo twem ho firi ho what you say e ma e ko ba na se time ye constitution no company ye wi ya ji tu mo no mo ne nam na na mo de campaign se constitution no e rollins de ene at the pound for ni kaya ye for ni ho ade ade adwene na twero constitution no Anti constitution or no NDC ni atanasi at scrutiny a dear good paper so na ye de jumano look who nim emrano and chino kiti kiti na wo yen de eye kwa a kwa to say obana or no ne ba ena omu ye na ba ko ada or no ne ba so amani bana u na adye chin yeno ni wa dan ne bano so amane u ni se hey Eye me ba ni me ba ne wo etin kwa munu. Afi ye kwa hine ni mwa. Ni ono da ne ba so ma ne ba. E wu ye no. Onu mwum. E kacho o hine se eh. O hine. Eye me ba. Eye me ba. Na o hine se oki se. O ba di ya na wisu se. Na ba di ene me be che mkola ni mwye nu. Me be akola ni me be che ni mwye nu. Me di si ka be che ni mwye nu. Na me de fama wede me de fama wede. O se o hine ye ne sa. Ye ne sa mame. Ye ne sa, eno kwa ne bide diya sou mjye beba. Nen diye bie mwen se. Nen diye bie lusu. Adi eno. Isi, eno hen nou se no. Akwa wii. Mami wii. Uye, uye mamboy ni pa 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 pa. O nye papa. O nye papa. Abofra no. Eye mami wii diya. Because mami no. Ne abofra ni yene diya no. No te se. O hene se ubi chen mounu. O se debi o hene. O diye. Se sa hane tiye diya. O diye fa abofra no ma. Mami no mami. So there, say you be cool about fun on Kwan there, baby. Eh, me ba, but I say say me ba. Now say, me so me say me ba na inintu be chap kola no mi noa. Oh dear, far about fun the man. Ma kola no on tina ukum no on fun. Be pesa kola no tina ukum. Because eh ne ba nti osro owa o o yaudi like owa abadaye de ma about fun so on pesa about fun no eh then eh say on pesa about fun no shere ne mkuwa or bo about fun no hubai. What you say? Now back when the only the only abreast or hen in champ of friend me no. Now she say we dear we dear or hen in whom the end no. No, ya we young po extra sab of friend or ya mammy we dear. And what did the ma ma men now say me young whom of friend? So now we are NDC ni MPP for what you say? NDC for no omu ena constitution no omu ye ye omu ne chro ye. Ena omu chro ye no omu me pesa ene. A coban said, You be too constitution, a cuckoo. You best say constitution, no. What you ask ye? Hell, the fourth republic, no. A moon may pese a chinana BBS nature say, Ya two first republic, no, a goo. And he said, MP before starting, hey, 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 no, my dee, um, per se, dear Sumbia Casa, sometimes come with me, my omunya, move out, no, modi, omudi, a firm, or move his own, me a patapama, and ya patapano, me a chair, and this fool. And ya man, no minimum chair, and this fool. But and this fool, no, F. Jenna say, look, constitution, ya, ne, Troy, fourth republic, no, ya, nine so, and a nacy. And he dis uncle for a chair, may I may say, I dear no crown, I boy in an ashy in a. It is sometimes when they are full in a ma yen su yen full in the chile and ma at the anonco jinsum. And you know, they didn't empty the guinea empty before ya, a ya sometimes empty this for you, a you menino. Nasset chirano, what you ask ye? But a camiaque say, I say, and then no empty before a ya de ashias ya done in na. Or more ye at the eh, fence saying. Uh, NDC for um, or millions, you know, a bed than your weakness. Thinking, say, NDC for us, or mono, or when you be a lion, chess, you beat me a bar for muscle. And tea, money, pabaco, a ban police service, a uh, police institution, Maseho, Ghana Army, Maseho, a friend saying, judiciary, Maseho, chess, 
Ghana ha electoral commission ma say ho ba bi ha mo say say institutions no mo say say ho nyina che say e hin fa biem na aka na say wo sa de wadwene wa asem be ba parliamentarians wa na che say wo no aye wadwene say oman ne na wo say no enti ya si ensuo ta upon chere ne a oje wo now speaker of parliament say member group of whom say e mra no yete ase ye na mafia no so e betimi abɔ na bidibinti ena sebe 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 da chia semti na bidibinti ena oba etumri ka oso ne nofo nye se bi fira to ntida enti se mo jire mo hume na mo je mo hume na this time around e be chira mo mafia so i want my lawyers to also follow up and use the same procedure ah to attorney general faso no eye mra da ho ma ga na di bia so bet me ayusu so i am also using the same procedure to appeal say yen free case no mam say supreme court ya so den no wan free case no and term said your year no there or year ma eye akufu ado ne ni attorney general na dia e che say eye bo apaye eye plan a strategy ma ye ma dwene say mu no baafia na mo ba be maafia na fi me Abang Bagwin, Speaker of Parliament, the number three man in Ghana. Man, who's okay? I feel the more the banshee abe bongo. Na yem fan face or ni yem she ni yem oh be chinu ukrumha. Yes, ni yem she di yem oh e be chinu ukrumha because look, government ni tu mi na e o Parliament e mrano a yedi e jumano e chrese. Adi ebiya ye di be ye ejuma ye be jia tumugan ha se ye tax se ye loan se ye di ben se parliament and di en tum na wo president or whoever we are swading na wo ko ye sa di ano na wo the far parliament on ko ye no se di wo pe na se abain SSA you can go to jail. Doesn't matter whether you are president or whatever, you can go to jail because what bomb I no crono. But be a was at the end a jitu mse a yem marano. One found faho. But be a was a jitu mse okay. A be far hunty a chase ya approve a chase and ya crono de enti. So one found go faho pe a ya crono de enti. Be be a two mean nash a parliament enti. Se parliament castle or barbie disturb a buyer a buy unyan nine crumpoon with genasso. Nancy, Kakampo, Shaky, Alban Bagwin, Shaky, Akufa do Crash, Oh, Senna, and Nibraba Krumha. And the Alban Bagwin say, Speak of Parliament say, This time, or no so fast I'll proceed the answer, or so my I say, The end of a cosso, no, or no son is stand. And the ne, if you never go, mobile bones, mobile bones, yeah, eh, be as all, eh, and nuna, a maha, my yargas on peso or canny baby. <laughs> and this will be on person can be be speaker so on person can be good yeah yes we have for procedure so near the time frame ah a year chief justice the best friend as someone now you know 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 you na wa wa comment e wo wa bien chere bia otimi ja comment e de to comment section na se se de be ya bit mi ama yin na ya hu adwen chere na wa share video no so so ama fofro so so answer to me aka pen dream tv ya se edamu yopo ma never as ma pen dream tv pen dream tv de o se edamu yopo